hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Rika Anik for those who are new and in today's video we are talking about summer dresses <laughs> So hopefully your summer is not a complete bust due to Rona Rona. In New York things are kind of starting to open back up. We have the outdoor dining, have a lot of outdoor attractions um, that are starting to open up this week. So in a sense, I still have time to have a bit of a hot girl summer or are we doing savage summer right now? I'm not really sure, but the good thing is Things are open and there is opportunity to, you know, get dressed up and go out and still salvage what's left of the summer. So today I'm pulling some of my favorite styles of dresses for you guys. I got some new in bits, some old classics that I want to show you. I think these dresses are perfect for summer. They don't go out of style and really you'll have them in your closet year after year. Before we get into it, give this video a thumbs up. It really helps me a lot and don't forget to subscribe if you're new. Once we've done all of that, we can go ahead and jump right on into the video. So linen has got to be hands down my favorite summer fabric. It's super breathable, not clingy, and if there's any moisture, it's super absorbent. So I definitely love linen. Another thing that I absolutely love about linen is really how timeless it looks as well. It's one of those fabrics that it literally, it never goes out of style. And for me, when I want to look like I made like some serious effort, I just draw from my linen and I know I'm good to go. So I have a lot of linen in my closet from dresses, tops, shorts, pants, I have quite a bit. It's not really intentional but I think every year or almost every year I always add a linen piece or two. And this year was no different. <laughs> you have to bear with me, I was meant to be on holiday right now guys so yeah bear with me. I got two new linen dresses which I wanted to wear on holiday this year. So the first one is this drapey kind of dress it doesn't look like much on the rack but i'll try it on for you guys and it's in like a ashy gray fabric and i absolutely love this dress i got it from asos and this style i think it's about maybe a year two years tops i saw this dress on a lot of influencers last year and i was influenced <laughs> i really wanted to get my hands on this style but it was sold out i guess because it did so well last year they decided to bring it back this year in some new colors so that's how i got my hands on this one and this time around i did not wait or you know save it on my wish list which is what i like to do as soon as i saw it i grabbed it like right away and i could not be happier with this dress i absolutely love it i love the draping on it it just feels like really elegant really classy i feel like this is something i will have for many many years and that's the feel that linen kind of pulls off a very timeless look it's just something that you know once you have it in your closet you know you'll get a lot of wear out of it so that's this first dress my next piece of linen for you guys is this tuxedo style dress well not it's a tuxedo dress and it's in linen and it has this belt detail at the front that you can use to you know cinch you in i really like um the buckle which is the tortoise shell with a touch of orange in there and like a gold plate so i really like that it definitely stands out on the oatmeal color i love the darting that they have in the bus that's like key especially when you're packing up here those little details go a long way so i really love that on the sleeve they have slits in the sleeve which i think is a nice touch even though it's long sleeve it still works in the summer because it's like so breathable and really lightweight so i really uh love this dress i would wear this for maybe like a brunch i'm going to get drinks uh, perfect again linen so perfect perfect for summer let me know in the comments which of the two linen dresses um 
is your favorite is it the tuxedo style dress here or the first one which is very architectural and drapey let me know in the comments So my next style for summer is the slip dress and nothing says easy breezy to me quite like a good slip dress they come in a variety of lengths and they're really easy to style as well you can pair them with flats sneakers heels depending on your mode and you can also layer them as well with maybe a t-shirt or a crop top or you can put a light cardigan over it as well sometimes you do have a chilly summer night so a light cardigan over a slip dress really works as well so something to think about if you're on the market for a slip dress definitely grab yourself one or two or three but yes definitely get you a slip dress so my first slip dress is this oldie but goodie i wore this for my birthday two years ago and i love the finish on it it's kind of like a i would call this like a metallic gold foil type of vibe going on and i haven't really seen a lot of dresses with this finish so i think this is a very unique and that's one of the reasons why i love it the neck is a cowl neck i love cowl neck it's very flattering on a larger bust on the side you have uh, a drawstring detail which i love i think it accentuates the hips and the bum really nicely so i love this dress the next um, slip dress I want to show you is a little bit shorter and I picked this up a couple of weeks ago. So still new, tag is on there, haven't worn it yet. But what I really love about this dress is the draping detail that's going on um, in the midsection right here. It just elevates a very simple dress and I don't really see a lot of um, slip dresses that have this kind of architectural detail going on in the front here another reason why i love this kind of draping when i eat i get a little bit bloated so it's nice to have this little drape here to hide the bloat if you can relate to the after dinner bloat let me know in the comments i think you'll definitely appreciate something like this so yes this is the newest edition it's in like a champagne creamy color i love you know shades like this tones like this it's very very timeless so another trend for summer is a bold print whether that's something tropical some tie-dye or just some abstract shapes um summer is definitely time where you can experiment and have fun now i'll be honest with you and if you've been following me for a minute now then you already know i'm not really a crazy color person i don't do crazy color but this year i really wanted to make an effort so if you saw a couple videos back i did the stored unboxing video i got a colorful bag which is kind of peeping up there <laughs> i got a colorful bag and i got a really loud and out there colorful dress so that's me making an effort but yeah this is the dress and just an example of you know a bold and colorful printer and like i said summer is definitely the time to experiment and do things like this so yeah that's what i did with this one and again it's long flowy i love the drawstrings on the side the back has a bit of drama as well with the kind of low cut and then you have the strings at the back so a lot of um attention to detail with this print i love the orange i think orange complements me very well so yeah can't go wrong with that Right, so I know what you guys are thinking <laughs> like who the heck wears knits in the summer <laughs> but hear me out it's not your typical knit that you would wear in like fall winter 
no it's not that heavy stuff think lightweight very breathable just like your linen a really nice knit dress can definitely definitely elevate your summer wardrobe or your summer look so the brand Jacquemus which is one of my favorite brands right now I hope I'm saying that right apologize in advance if I just like slaughtered the word but yep this brand right here that's one of my favorite um, fashion brands to follow online I don't own anything by them just yet but but this brand really got me into the idea of wearing knitwear in the summer i think they executed so beautifully so my summer wardrobe is kind of inspired by that i'm not very good with colors <laughs> but one of my favorite knit dresses is kind is this kind of yellowy creamy beigey kind of dress <laughs> sorry I'm not very good with colors, but it's more yellow. It's definitely more yellowy, more yellowy. Not like super yellow, but a very soft muted yellow. And it's in knit, um, um, kind of like a bodycon style, but not very clingy or form fitting. Like I mentioned with the knit, if you look at that, I don't know if the camera is showing that for you guys, but yeah, it's very breathable i can almost see through it another knit option as well oh this one is a little bit more of a mustardy yellow i got this in zara as you can see the knit it's not compact but you can definitely see through it so again don't expect to be sweating crazy bullets um it's long it has the split that's it guys we've come to the end of this video which of the summer dress styles were your favorite i know for me linen definitely takes the top spot i feel like you can't go wrong with a lovely linen dress but i would love to hear what you think so leave me a comment down below if it's your first time here and you made it to the end hit that subscribe button i would definitely appreciate it also don't forget to give this video a like it really helps me a lot thank you guys so much for watching this video and until next time bye